All right, I'm going to read for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, and Ascendant. This is for May 2024. So Capricorn, this is for you for love, around love. Okay. I think for Capricorn, Capricorn doesn't really want to have to work on their relationships. They just want them to work. They don't have the time to work on relationships. They have to be, you know, content. They want to be content. They don't want to be overworked, overburdened. Um, I really don't think that they want to spend or waste time there because they are busy people. They like to focus on their projects, their jobs, their responsibilities, making money, creating things, building things. They do not want to spend time on any of the drama. So when it comes to that, they're like, no, no, no drama, no drama allowed. Okay, so as far as Capricorn, the relationship has to be flowing so that they're, they stay involved, they stay engaged. Some of you have been dealing with a low vibration from your partner and maybe it's not it differently. You will work on a relationship in order to communicate properly with each other out of respect. But if it's like banging your head against the wall, you won't. You just back out, back away and not uh, pay much mind to it. But if that's you, then you're not happy because if you can't get some change um, in order for you to be happy in your relationship, uh, you'll be distracted. You'll certainly be distracted. Oops. Well, usually distracted means um, some sort of addictive personality, obsessive, compulsive, something like that. So if you are in a relationship that is causing you to go within, this is the type of thing you're going to do instead. You're going to be taking a good look at whether the relationship is working for you. And for those of you that have it working for you and it's a tent relationship, I really think that you're just going to keep on building on that. There may be some people in the family that are not very happy or having some issues that may bring issues to your love affair. Uh, but overall, I think you will work it out with your partner. Some things you just won't give time to, like I said. What happens for you is you just wait until people's drama stops. And for those of you that are looking for love, you're gonna find something this month and it'll just flow into you. It'll be easy. As long as you're going out to get connected, if you're doing something to get connected, you're gonna be doing well. Uh, I would say those single Capricorns have been kind of lonely and feeling as if they have been like the fruit left on the vine. Well, this month of May, you're gonna be the first fruit picked. <laughs> Good job, Capricorn. Have some fun. You know, it's spring. You, and Capricorn's favorite thing to do is, you know, <laughs> Capricorn. Look at that death, that devil card. You can only imagine the truth of a Capricorn. 